Today I'm going to be pouring lightweight concrete panels using four parts per light and one part Portland cement. <laughs> Here's our perlite. I mean, pretty standard issue stuff. Now, normally, when you're working with perlite, or most lightweight concrete aggregates, you want to wet them down first because they're so dry and they absorb so much water. It's a little bit difficult to work with when you're making a concrete mix. In this case, this is totally dry because I want to keep track of how much water I'm using. But ideally, you do want to pre-wet your aggregates before you make lightweight concrete with perlite. There are a lot of different ways that you can mix concrete together, but I'm going to be using a drill with a paddle attachment to mix this perlite concrete. Four parts perlite, one part Portland cement, and just enough water to get it to all mix together. So we, we used in total there over a liter and a half, just a bit over a liter and a half is what I would call that. Now take a look at the consistency that we've got here. Try to get some on the trowel for you. It's not bad. I don't know if I've got enough here. Let's go ahead and spread it out, see how it turns out. No, not even close. I'd say I got about half of what I need there. More than half, but not enough. Just a little bit more. Back up to two liters. Not that it really matters, but.
Okay, now that's something that I can be happy with. Four parts perlite to one part Portland cement, lightweight concrete. Let's go ahead and demold these. They're not cured yet. They're only about a week or 10 days old. They're strong enough now that I can take them out of the mold and make some more prototypes to experiment with, but they still need more time to cure. I want one month at minimum so we can achieve the full cure strength before we do our strength test on these. This one feels really light. Now I'll just go ahead and get this all cleaned up and reset for another batch of lightweight concrete prototypes. <laughs> 